stress often catches you by surprise, and these 11 videos will stress you out big time. Number 11. An office worker is sitting quietly at her desk when she throws down her phone at 1 minute and 18 seconds, which begins to flare up and sizzle. She leans over the device to clear her desk at 1 minute and 25 seconds, which I don't think was the right decision. If the battery pops here, her face is in direct range. They all gather around the broken phone and record it in case something else happens. It continues to sizzle from the middle of the screen. But other than that, it looks strangely fine. Try and translate what they are saying here if possible. <laughs> Number 10. A repairman is caught on CCTV walking around the bedroom of two girls. He looks at something over his shoulder, perhaps checking to see that he is not being watched, before reaching inside of a clothes hamper and touching their dirty laundry. Later on, he returns without a mask and goes back to the same hamper. He comes up with a piece of laundry and immediately faces the door again, possibly to see if anyone is near. I don't know what this repairman thinks he's doing, but it's obvious that this is not what he was hired for. Finally, he comes back to possibly pocket the laundry for later, following the movement of his hands at the 48 second mark, and you can see there's strong evidence of him taking it. He has not been sentenced yet, but I think it's going to be really hard to argue these charges with this level of direct video evidence. Based on what you've seen here, what do you think this person's punishment should be if he is found guilty? Number 9. A YouTuber named Ponji Petualan is searching for frogs with his friends late at night along with anything else they can find. The team has their head down to look for prey, but at 21 minutes and 4 seconds, Punji looks up for the briefest of moments and catches this bipedal creature as it sprints away from the light. It happens so fast that they don't even appear to see it at first. It appears to be a pale white and instinctively flees from the light, which makes sense for a nocturnal creature to do. It does not make a sound as it moves, despite being the size of a human and a very close distance away. Hello. Number 8. A YouTuber named Tate Steinseek is investigating an old building in Oklahoma City that was once a psychiatric institute. He claims that around 4 a.m. he experiences paranormal activity and wants to document it. This time, a black container slides across the ground on its own. Watch this part and tell me if there's any way to fake this. Alright, did you guys just see that? I would say that it was a rope or something tied around the container, but it happens again much closer, and I don't know how this could be faked. Did you guys can see that okay he even shows it up close and you can see nothing is attached to it at all and nothing special is inside so your guess is as good as mine number seven the sorel weed house is said to be one of the most haunted buildings in all of savannah georgia two different women have met their end here one of them named matilda who is said to still roam the courtyard in her black dress while taking a tour of the area, a YouTuber named Billy Smith captures this quick video of a woman fleeing the house, wearing an all-black corset. What's weird is how she never actually opens the front door to her left. Instead, she appears out of nowhere to cross the space between two columns, and then does emerge from the other side. According to Billy, this figure was heading in the opposite direction of the parking lot, so if they were a staff member, they would have to double around to get to their car eventually. He waited until 1.30 in the morning and saw no one else from the house for the rest of the night and certainly no other traces of her. Number 6. A YouTuber named S. Zacharia is exploring a construction site when he comes across a peculiar hole in the ground that somehow feels off. He is curiously poking around with a stick when an anguished voice calls out to him from below, followed by a strong underground wind. This part definitely sounds like a person crying out for help. Wow. 
soon their cries are replaced by another sound, this one much different than the first. I don't think human vocal cords could ever produce the noises that follow. <laughs> A final moan is soon drowned out by the chorus of supernatural screeches. Is this person being tormented by evil spirits, or is he himself becoming one of them? Number 5 this CCTV video captures a large figure lurking beneath a bush on an empty street. It's hard to tell what it is at first, until the camera zooms in for a better look. Some kind of humanoid is low to the ground, as if waiting to grab someone, anyone who walks by. It looks like it could be a person, until it dips its head from the shadows at 1 minute and 58 seconds to reveal an upsettingly long face with large, gnashing jaws. The way it repeatedly moves side to side looks like it's probably just a looping animated sequence, but what's your take? Number 4. A YouTuber named Frosty Flakes is searching for elk in the woods of Imnaha, Oregon. Oregon when his elk whistle attracts a pack of hungry wolves. Soon they find themselves surrounded and have to step carefully. They are way outnumbered and the wolves sound very close by, ferocious and closing in fast. The wolves are exactly on opposite sides of us. Every time they stop to gain a sense of direction, they can hear the wolves combing through the area where they just were. And I think this is where the pack decides not to pursue any further and lets them off with a warning howl. They sound close enough to charge the entire time, yet hidden so well in their surroundings that you would never know where to even look until it was already too late. Number 3. A YouTube channel called Mysterious Oklahoma received this video from a subscriber who claims to have kept seeing something out of the corner of their eye in one spot of their house, so they set up a camera to record. What they capture is a fast-moving creature they refer to only as the Thing, which apparently moves so fast the camera has trouble keeping up. When you pause on it, you can see a very small figure that looks to be slightly lower resolution than the rest of the video, so it might not be real. Number 2. A YouTuber named Chris Javier is making a random vlog around his neighborhood late at night when he gets the weird feeling that he's not alone. Moments later, the streetlight he's standing by goes off and on by itself, which he says it has never done before. He thinks it might just be his imagination, so he decides to further test the situation by directly communicating with whatever is controlling the light, which seems to respond more than once. Here is the first time. What the heck is going on? And then the streetlight seems to taunt him even as he walks away. Was this a coincidence, or is there no possible way? Now it's not even turning off. <gasps> as soon as I just said something about it, it turns off. A short while later, Chris sees a disheveled figure walk out from the back alley where he was just standing. They seem totally out of it and speak aggressively to an imaginary person in front of them. At this point, Chris decides to get out of there because it's early in the morning and no one else is around. But to his surprise, the stranger soon follows. The person then abruptly returns to the back alley from where they came and begins to shudder under the same streetlight that was acting weird earlier. They seem drawn to this area and they start swinging their arms wildly in a circle, totally forgetting about Chris as he films the scene for a while longer and then gets away between the light seemingly responding to Chris's voice and a man randomly appearing from an empty back alley moments later. 
There just seems to be too many coincidences in this video to deny the paranormal could have been at work that night. Before we get to number one, my name is Chills, and if you're curious about what I look like in real life, then go to my Instagram at Dylan is Chillin YT and tap that follow button to find out. I recently released the number 15 mixtape, but I don't think you should follow these instructions to check it out. It's a proven fact that generations Generosity makes you a happier person. So if you're generous enough to hit the subscribe button and the bell beside it, then thank you. Also, don't forget I upload a new video here on YouTube every Thursday and Saturday. Number 1. Citizens gather around in awe of a statue that mysteriously began gushing an off-colored substance from holes in the feet. Looking at this part of the video close up, it seems logical to believe that this could actually be a miracle of some kind. But when they start collecting the liquid in a bottle for later blessings, you'll see the substance is actually a dirty brownish yellow. That's because it's not divine intervention at all, but rather a clogged sewer pipe leaking untreated water onto the mall. Nobody in this video knows it at the time, but they are ingesting and rubbing raw sewage into their mouth, eyes, and skin. But judging by their smiling faces, there doesn't seem to be a single skeptic in the crowd. Sometimes I find the most terrifying videos might take a moment for the fear to set in, but when it does, it hits twice as hard. 